It's holiday time again in China with the upcoming Labor Day on May 1st guaranteeing Chinese workers a well-deserved three-day mandatory break. But with national fun times comes a higher price, and hotel rooms are already raising their rates in anticipation of domestic tourism. According to news from the People's Daily, hotel rates are peaking earlier than expected during this time of year, thanks to residents' desire to enjoy the warmth of the short spring season and avoid the crushing chaos of the May holidays by taking their leave earlier. Popular website 17.cn provides reservation services for plane tickets, hotel accommodation and tours. The website recently published a report about national hotel rates in March, which clearly indicated hotel prices have been on the increase earlier this year than before. For some Chinese cities, hotel rates have seen a price jump of more than 70 percent, with cheap low-end and economy hotels hiking the most. In the city of Jinnan, Shandong province, hotel rates have gone up by an average of $15 across town. And heading south of the country to Guangzhou and Hainan Island, prices get even higher. Most hotels have increased by one or two-fold their normal rates. Budget hotel rates have increased by 100% on average. Three- and four-star hotels are up 150%, while five-star hotels are reported to have inched even further, an amazing 200% hike. This means an average $160 a night stay can now cost tourists up to $635 a night. But to be fair, Guangzhou's soaring hotel fares are not just due to the May Labor Day holidays. It's also because the city is currently hosting the Guangzhou Trading Fair right now, which will continue until early May. Thousands of people have flocked to the city to purchase goods for bargain prices at the fair. Thankfully, Hainan Island can offer some reprieve for those looking for a better bargain. The Hainan Price Bureau has put a limitation on the price hikes for hotel rates, stating that hotels must not raise their original rates by more than 50% for the May holidays. The limitation will be lifted once the holiday period is officially over. Don't go anywhere because when we get back, we'll take a look at why some Chinese believe the May holidays are not the perfect time to travel anymore. That's up next.